This isn't the only instance. Now, before I bring in our guests, let's listen in to some other voices. An Air India aircraft uh, came into Delhi from Kabul earlier this evening. It's brought back some Afghans, some Indians, all, all talk about fear on the streets of Kabul. I can't believe the world abandoned Afghanistan. <laughs> Our friends are going to get killed. They're going to kill us. Our women are not going to have any more rights. I can't believe the world abandoned Afghanistan. <laughs> Our friends are going to get killed. They're going to kill us. Our women are not going to have any more rights. As far as I came from Kabul, so the Kabul was occupied by Taliban. And I think there will be a new government. There will be a new government, maybe a new settlement. So yet it's not clear who will be next president, what will happen. So everyone is waiting. He should be. He should be because whatever has happened, that's because of, because of him and his corrupt team. Ambassador Vishnu Prakash, women's rights, is that now going to be a thing of the past in Afghanistan? You, hear, you heard two ladies we spoke to, both in tears, both saying that it's not just about a hijab, it's about not having any rights at all. Gaurav, the pictures of women being stoned to death by the brave Taliban soldiers, brave because they can build stones at women and kill them, are still vivid in everybody's memory. But before, also let us remember that there is this, the strongest country in the world whose president talks of democracy, human rights, religious freedoms. I, if somebody were to talk about that again, I think we should just uh, remind them of what has been done to, the, uh, to Afghanistan. The sheer hypocrisy of uh, the Committee of Nations is galling. And the worst sufferers will be the women, will be the children. It is something that was unbelievable, uh, the kind of stories that were narrated, these, the tales that were spun. Oh, it will take nine months for uh, the Kabul to fall. Oh, it will take 90 days. I mean, the way the whole thing has been choreographed, crafted, is absolutely unbelievable. But it shows that nobody is above board. Everybody is culpable in this uh, treachery that has been... Uh, uh, Strong words. This is treachery. This is treachery, you say. And these are words that are being echoed on the streets of Kabul. Uh, there are reporters who are saying that there is tremendous anger against the United States of America. Did the US actually lead the people of Afghanistan up the garden path for two decades? There's more news that's just coming in. Taliban commanders are now saying that they've taken control of the Afghan presidential palace, which is President Ashraf Ghani's palace is now in control of the Taliban. Incidentally, President Ashraf Ghani has fled to Tajikistan with the National Security Advisor and some senior leaders of the earlier regime. I have Nigel Walker, Communications Advisor of the Norwe Norwegian Afghanistan Committee, joining me on the broadcast. Nigel Walker, what's the latest? And you do you share this uh, opinion that we are hearing from Afghanistan that women's rights, 20 years, women started looking forward to a brighter future. All of that will now be a thing of the past. Good evening. This uh, is going to be unfortunate. Um, all the gains that have been made in the last 20 years. Um, but I think there is still some hope that um, things could not be as worse as, as we all fear. Um, but on what basis are you saying that there is hope that things will not be as bad or worse? I think that the um, I think the the country has has changed um, quite a bit in the last few years uh, in terms of attitudes towards um, you know women women's rights educational rights and a lot of those young people are going to be needed to sustain a government. Um, a Taliban government. So I think 
you don't have the same people. None of us know, for, you know at this point. I mean, we don't know. It looks like now the, the, the Taliban will control the government and take over. Um, and we will just have to see. The, the history isn't great, but um, I, I, I try and think positively about that, these types of things, so because... That, that's you know. hope. And, 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 okay, stay with me for a moment. Uh, Ambassador, Ambassador Vivek Aju, do you share this optimism? Uh, as I told, submitted to you, we simply don't know how the Taliban would behave. Uh, it is likely that those Taliban who have been exposed to international opinion would try to urge uh, the people you mentioned, uh, Mullah Umar's son, Yaqub, uh, I think that's his name, uh, Hebatullah, the head of the Taliban, also the Haqqani network people, who I think, for all their terrorism, uh, have a little more idea of the world, that uh, the 2021 is not the 1990s. And that even their friends, the Chinese and the Russians, who will be very loath to deny the Taliban legitimacy. And as I submitted to you, by not attacking the Hazaras, they're yes. showing a degree, of, or not even entering the area, they're showing a degree of sophistication. It would lead me to believe that they would urge that, uh, that some kind of a system, something like it is practiced on women, on gender issues, like it's practiced in Iran or in some, uh, in, in say, the... Arab Peninsula countries, or what was in Saudi Arabia, okay. where let us not forget okay. women were not allowed to drive, and yes. there was no franchise, etc. That some kind of a system with which the world uh, could live with, uh, that that should be put in place. Fair However, enough. However, what one what one doesn't know is whether the rank and file. And uh, these people who are more insular, who remained in Quetta, who've uh, not gone out, whether they would be more in, would be amenable to listen to this kind of advice. So that is why I say that there is a question mark. We'll the track that story is... very closely. Ambassador, give me a moment. Implications for India. That's coming up on the other side of a quick break. Sandeep, stay with me. That big story.